Uh, all right. Broca for your hoa. Broca for your shy. Broca for your hoa. Broca for your hoa shy. Broca for your hoa. Broca for your hoa shy. All right, man. Uh, you know, we just finished camp. Um, you know, and then pretty much just um, just a quick vid I'm gonna do here, man. You know, you know, just to keep a bit of the spirit flowing. But um, you know, I mean. Yeah, man, you know, we go out in that battlefield every week. That's our, our job, and then, you know, I mean, pretty much, man, we got an end goal to this, man. End goal to all this. And the end goal is the kingdom, man. You know, so, I mean, if you're looking around, man, you, you've seen a lot of things happening that's alluding to prophecy. But you know what the scripture says? This is warned to you that have lost patience, you know? So, you know, Pretty much, man. We just gotta keep, you know, exposing this system. Keep teaching them the word, the, 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 the gospel. You know, keep pushing that vibration that the end's coming, man. Because we're in the well, we're in the end. So we gotta keep our our, our fires burning. Because to be fair, man. Uh, you know, you got individuals that. Well, the, you know what the scripture says, Ephesians five and fifteen. See that ye walk circumspect. So, if you're not working circumspect, man, you, you know you're not, you're not, you're not looking around and seeing the signs. You're gonna get deterred. You're gonna be caught up in fucking what's going on and in fucking NFL, football, Instagram, and that's not that's not we ain't that's not what we're supposed to be watching for. We're supposed to be watching for just storms, uh, uproars of the people. Even this thing with the cashless, you know, the average person they don't really understand what the cashless means. They, they don't understand because they don't know what the what the goal of the elites are. That's why you got certain Israelite groups saying, "Oh, nah, the RFID is not the mark of the beast." The reason why he's saying that is because you don't know. According to, you don't know what the plans of the elites are, man. The plans of the elites is to chip everybody. Sorry. Now, if you knew that, then you would. When you see certain things going on, like this country implementing a national ID card for everybody to get. Like the guy going on in Jamaica and Maldives, things like cashless. Then you'd be like, you know what? That makes sense. That ties into Revelations um, um, uh, 13. You know? It's like uh, Mr. Russo, that guy who, who exposed the um, agenda of the, work, the, the elites, man. And you know, that guy ended up dead after that interview, shortly after that interview, right? Yeah. Because, you know, he exposed the agenda. Of the actual elites, man. You know, so he had to go. But he knew, he knew what time it was, man. That's why it wasn't so far fetched for him to see, you know, that that was actually soon gonna happen. That's right, man. You know. So, I mean, these are these are some these are some impromptu thoughts because uh, we just finished camp and we're just driving. I ain't gonna bring out no scriptures right now. I ain't got. I mean, I'm using my, you know. You know, brothers, whatever. But so I'm not gonna. But basically, that's it, man. You got, um, uh, you know, the plans of the elites is to get. Didn't Evelyn Rothschilds come on the TV and, and said they was talking about the economy and boosting the economy. He said, well, really, what we want to get. How we, I'm getting old now. We need to be thinking about how we're gonna get an international currency. He don't care about no fucking dollars. What about no fucking pounds? These elites want people chipped with the RFID tag, an international currency. They ain't talking about a fucking a quid or some, you know what I mean, or some kind of coin. They're talking about the RFID chip because everything is going cashless. That's why they're pushing this cryptocurrencies. The word crypt means hidden. Some fake, some, 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 some digital currency that you that you don't even touch so that's what they're pushing you know so you, you you know if you knew that then you would know it makes sense man you say you know what that makes sense you know and even with the uh, cryptocurrency i read an article a few weeks back they were saying that the imf is um interested in getting into the cryptocurrency as well man yeah. you know and obviously once that happens you know they'll regulate the system 
put their own laws um, into it and you know make it a thing where everyone has to abide by a certain way of dealing with it because right now it's unregulated the whole crypto world but obviously they want to get into that and then put their own rules and regulations in it and obviously that's going to come with the RFID chip it's the perfect segue you know into the RFID chip man as soon as, as, as uh, you know the IMF get involved and release which is obviously it's set by them anyway yeah you sell by them man. hidden currency and they don't know who the owner is it's, right. it's, you know but it's all conditioning it's all conditioning you know it's all preconditioning and um, you know I mean you got this national ID card that's gonna incorporate which they've already got it in the Maldives which is basically India or something like that the vote, you can use it to it's, a, it's one card that incorporates a conglomerate or things so you can use it to, as a dry, as your driving license you can use it to board a plane you can use it to make to, to, to pay for things it's, it's, it serves as your bank card too it serves as your ID it serves as your, your blood type card everything your, 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 your health card it's got your, bi your voice biometrics on it it's got your DNA that's the RFID system. So if it's a card, people can lose that. Watch, man. You watch, because they've already got people getting chipped in Sweden. So they've already got like they already got the method for what they want already in place. Well, you can't lose the RFID chip because it's in you. You know. So you know. So we're in the end, man. So we're gonna keep pushing these prophecies. You know, Lord will, and um. We're gonna keep exposing this system, man. Cause that's the jobs of the prophets, man. You know, where the apostle means sent sent out. And um the mean prophet means um, say, before. say before. So that's what we we sent out to to, to teach you like the the, mis the mysteries of the book. Amos 3 and 7. Surely the Lord doeth nothing, but he revealeth his secrets unto his servants, the prophets. Right. You know? So when you when open the book of Revelation, you read about the dragon, or let's say you read about the beast, the beast is NATO in the EU. The whore that sit on the back, on the beat, on, on the, that's America. The whore of Babylon, man. That's America. You know, the mark, the image of the beast, that's his system. You know, getting a degree, following his philosophies, all that, being in his system, man. You know, you got the, everybody, everybody that's going to college and trying to get mortgages. They they love the way this way of life. When your Christmas comes, you're gonna see everyone with their Christmas trees out, having going to these Christmas parties and getting drunk, you know, committing adultery and stuff. And then the mark of the beast is that's his mark, that's his RFID tag. So that with that, he's basically he's that's the part of the system now where he wants to do two things, which is against the scriptures. Number one, number the people. He, he sits in the temple of God thinking he's, he's the Lord. And number two, in, in, inserting uh, technology into people, man. First of all, you ain't supposed to insert anything into your fucking skin. There's another law, bro. So that's his mark, but he's gonna use that as you being a slave. Okay, now if you knew the scriptures, you would know that those are two things that are wrong with it for straight up. It's a serious thing, it's a serious deal. You know, at least you didn't know. So, you know, that's what that is, man. So, we're in the time of the RFID, we're in the time of the Mark of the Beast. Um, and pretty much, you know, we know that Yahweh Shai is coming back in the UFOs and he's gonna um, destroy the whole system. You know, the Lord's not with the New World Order. The Lord's not with this system as it stands. Now, a lot of you people don't even know what the New World Order is. Well, mate, that's on you. There's so much information out there nowadays to show you what's going on in the world. If you don't have a clue about that, then you're just a cream filler. You know, you're just, you're just not on the level. You, you know, forget you, you're, you're just lost. And we're, we're too far in the game now for these copper top cream fillers. You know, you guys, you know, oh, no, that's conspiracies. I mean, oh, I can't, I mean, yeah, I mean, grow up, bro. Grow up. 
got a good scripture. Yeah, right, 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 right. So Romans 11 and verse 7. What then Israel have not obtained, which you seek it for, but the election have obtained it, and the rest were blinded. Yeah, man, that's right, man. Um, the Lord, it's a gift to have the wisdom because we, the scripture says many kings have desired to see the things that you see. Right. Now, you got the majority of the people on the earth. They don't know what's going on. They don't know that. They don't know nothing about the, the, the heavenly father and his son. You know, that they're watching this earth and they've got the angel scouts all right out here making things happen. They don't know that, man. They don't know. The elites know. A lot of these people don't even know that fucking Hollywood and Disney and all these satanic. A lot of these people don't know that their food is GMOs. These people don't, a lot of these people don't know this. Oh no, I mean the government would ensure that we get the finest them stock of crops and you know, no, they, they you know, they're, no, you're lost. You know? Any more of it? That's what I know about that. Right. And Ephesians chapter 2 and verse 8, we were saying about the faith, you know. For by grace are you saved through faith, and that not of yourselves, it is a gift of the hour. So, you know, uh, having faith is a gift from the hour, Hashem Yahushai. Eh? It's not something that um, you, can, you can work up on yourself, that you can conjure up from inside your own spirit. That has to be bestowed upon you through the Lord, man. Eh? You know, that's the only way you're going to get faith, man. Eh? And, you know, that really just goes back to, you know, being chosen in the beginning. Because only the elect are going to have faith and they're, they're going to believe, man, until the end, you know? Scriptures say that he, he that endure until the end the same shall be saved, man. Right? So that's the elect. That's not talking about, you know, the average Joe on the streets, man, you know? Or someone in, in a black unconsciousness community, man. If they don't come out of that, they're going to be destroyed, you know? The Lord has set up certain stumbling blocks for them guys to stay in until the end, man. They just weren't meant to make it, man. They were there to play their part as scoffers, you know, to scoff, come with, come with their vanity, and then get destroyed, man, through the nukes, man. You know, there's always there's always an election and there's always, you know, the undesirables that are not, not going to make it in this truth, man. You know? And that's the way the Lord set it up, and that's that's the balance, man. You know? There always has to be a balance. Everyone's got their role to play, so, you, you know, stay in your lane, man. It is what it is. That's right. That's right, man. Let's get Let's get the peace. Right, this is uh, Revelations 13 and uh, verse 16. And he calls you all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond. It says rich as well because you got a lot of in the, if what you gotta understand about the Rothschilds is they look at they look at themselves like they were both people. They actually say they're the Jews. Like Hannah Rothschild, she went, We're not British. We're Jews. We'll never be accepted. She don't even give a fuck about British people. And a lot of those governments, a lot of them are probably chipped, man. A lot of them are getting ready to get their ass chipped. They're a bunch of pawns. Already, the Rothschilds already outlaid that back in the day. Give me control over the nation's money. I don't give a fuck who makes the rules. Right. You think David Miliband and all them weasels have got anything on the Rothschilds? They, they, the Rothschilds, they're slaves, man, to the Rothschilds. So a lot of these rich people that you think, yeah, they got power, a lot of them don't know what's going on. Like, look, they put someone like Barack Obama in presidency. Right. And, you know, you get all these different leaders like Tony Blair and that. A lot of these dudes... There's some coke-headed fucking rich... They, got, they might have slave fucking um, masters in their family or some shit, man. Some mm. coked-up rich kids, man. Right. You know, that were just propped up for a job. But the, the Rothschilds won a lot of them chips. Okay. Yeah, they do. Okay. You think a lot, a lot of them dudes... So, so, the scripture says rich and poor... You, you, you figuring it's just our people on the street he's gonna get he wants he wants to be gods on the earth that's you don't understand what the mark of the beast is some of you people man he's trying to he's trying to he was trying to mimic the blessing of Jacob and be sovereign ruler over all peoples and have everyone in slavery that's exactly what he's trying to do it goes deeper the rabbit hole goes deeper than what you think it does 
oh, it's just a chip. No, it's not. You fucking stupid fucks. Go on now. Free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Go on. And that no man might buy or sell save he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. There you go. There you go. So, Esau's going to try and get everyone RFID tagged in this, you know? Yeah. And um, it's not going to work. Job 5 says the Lord disappointed after the vices of the crafty. Yeah. So, as soon as America's nuked, the whole shy is coming back, man. And he's going to, that's that, America going down is the, is the end of your kingdom. There's no build, there's no, there's nothing after that. Okay, unfortunately, mate. You might, you might be trying to say, yeah, planning this and that, but as soon as America is fucking nuked, that is your system done and finished. And the scripture says that, man, the smoke ascending forever and ever, and your whole is coming, and he's going to burn the beast, man. You know? That's right. I mean, anyway, it was a quick one, you know, so I'm going um, to wrap out, but, um, you know, um, that's it, man. You know, stay on top. Stay on top of the prophecies. You know, keep the fire burning. And um, Esau's out. Esau's out. Yahweh Shai and the kingdom is in. The kingdom is now. The kingdom is here, man. Yahweh Shai is going to crack them skies very soon. This place is done. You can already see that. You know? Anyway, man. You know, all praise to Yahweh Shai. Praise to Yahweh Shai.